Parents in Greenbrier are not too happy tonight after someone stole thousands of dollars worth of field equipment from the city softball fields just ahead of a big tournament. Carrie Kifford's Hillary Hunt is back from Greenbrier with the latest on this. What do you mean, now, Hillary? Well, guys, more than $15,000 worth of equipment, including a bad boy mower and a John Deere tractor, hauled off overnight. They cut that lock you see right there. And now the city is ponying up some cash in hopes of getting it back. To take from our kids like that is really disappointing. Laura Emberton, this is my daughter and she plays catcher, is a proud softball mom. But a recent crime in her town of Greenbrier has her in a foul this mood. The gate, they cut the lock. Shame on you. Shame on you. That's that's what I have to say. This police report detailing the trailer, mower, and tractor stolen from the fenced-in area at the city softball complex. The thieves snapping this lock and hauling off with more than $15,000 worth of the city's equipment. So what we're trying to do is uh, get the property back, number one, and number two, make an arrest on the ones that... that took the property. Greenbrier Police Chief Gene Earnhardt says this kind of stuff doesn't happen in his town, which is why he and Craig Johnson with the Parks and Rec Department have teamed up to offer an incentive to get the stuff back, hopefully in time for this weekend's big softball tournament. A reward for him if he gets caught, so he or she or them, I hope we catch them. And for parents like Emberton, she hopes whoever did this will take a lesson from her daughter's softball helmet. Yeah, it's sad that you have to steal from the children. Now, if you have any information on who could have taken the equipment or where it could be, it could cash in on that $1,000. All you got to do is call the Greenbrier Police Department and you can remain anonymous. Guys, back to you.